about, I think there's a confusion always about scumbling and glazing, what the difference is. Well, there is. I even looked it up on the uh, internet, one of my uh, infrequent forays onto the internet. <laughs> uh, but essentially, glazing uh, is a process where you want to intensify the color of a particular area. So you uh, use a lot of medium with it, the color you're going to glaze with. And glazing is essentially putting uh, a darker color over a lighter, lighter area as a, in, a very, in a very thin layer to intensify the color of that area. So that's glazing. And scumbling is the opposite of glazing. It's putting a lighter wash of a color over a darker area to raise the value of that area, to make it, uh, let's say, a little more atmospheric looking. Uh, it, give, it has kind of a, a, it tends to gray out the color underneath, uh, but it, it's the exact opposite of glazing in the sense that it's a lighter wash over a darker area to diminish the color and intensity of va the value as opposed to glazing, which is using a darker color over a lighter color to intensify the color. So the polar opposites. Wow. So um, mostly in glazing, you want to use transparent paint or more transparent colors? Or? You want to use more transparent colors, more intense colors like alizarin crimson, uh, Indian yellow, uh, you know, transparent green. Of course, you could make any color more transparent just by adding medium to it. Uh, oh. But it is a little more difficult, you know, with more opaque colors like the ochres and Venetian. But as I, you can glaze with just about any color. Okay. Just adding enough medium to it. Thanks, David. That's a good answer. <laughs> Thank you.